So I saw a very interesting tweet and I wanted to bring it here to talk about it. So it said, Versus was better at the peak of the pandemic because we had nothing else to do. But now it's forced. All right, I'm going to so let you handle this. My lips are sealed. Okay. Oh, wow. I, so I want to know what, what you guys think then, if Romeo don't want to. <laughs> Not I, everyone be at all women. I'm going to be very honest and I'm sorry if you don't agree with me. I never really cared about verses. Like mm. I watched it because I knew we would talk about it, but like it was never for me to be like, oh my gosh, I want to go see this. You know what I'm saying? Like I never cared to begin with pandemic or not. That's just me. Can I ask you a question? Is that because there weren't artists who um, were kind of like geared toward more the Gen Z generation mm -hmm. or so older mm. artists? Is that why you weren't yeah. interested? I think, I'm sure, yeah, that has a huge thing to do with it. But there are some classics like that we talked about, Brandy, and I forgot who she did it with. I'm terrible. But like, <laughs> I'm sorry. Wait a minute. It's, Brand it was, I, Monica, I, Monica. But I like Brandy, so I was like, oh, I want to watch it. Monica, sorry. I don't know. I'm so sorry. I forgot. You but don't know? No, it, I if it was it is. I just forgot that they did it together. I was focused on Brandy as my. Is mm. my so basically, what you're saying, if if it was Lil Uzi and Gunna, you would have been right there, phones Honestly, out. <laughs> no, because it's just. I mean, maybe. Let's not lie. But, <laughs> um, <laughs> I definitely would have been hyped, but I still can't say I would have been like, oh, I'm gonna sit here for an hour and just watch them play a song that I could go on spotify and listen to if that makes sense well i honestly have to agree with the tweet because we're busy like we're back on the road we're back working like when the pandemic first hit we didn't have anything else to do so we were just in the house mm -hmm. with our phones and our computers so mm -hmm. it was like cool i'll enjoy a little free concert by you know one of my favorite artists but now mm, no and artists are back on the road too like little baby and dirk just announced their tour two seeds going on tour you know so it's like they're not going to just be doing free concerts at this point either because they could go make money and tour from it. So I think in the pandemic, it made sense. But now I agree with you, Jamie. I'm not checking out no verses. I'm going to be jazz, honest. Don't get it twisted, though. These artists are making bread at these verses. Like, these contracts... <laughs> Yeah, but I have to say, too, during the pandemic, artists were trying to stay relevant. Now it's like you can go on tour and you, you got your relevancy back. It was nice. a point where you couldn't tour. So it was like, well, yeah, social media has to be my friend at this point. Now it's not necessary. Things are back to normal. So let me ask y'all this. Do y'all think if they made a versus live tour that it would sustain the whole versus enterprise, that it would continue to go? I think that... I it might, you might be onto something with that one, Anton. I don't, you might have something. Yeah, now I would be down with them taking it to concert, but I'm not going to lie, y'all. You know, some some um things that happen on the phone, like it'd be the best seat in the house. You know what I'm saying? Like <laughs> going to the concert is nice, you know, front row, but sometimes I don't got front row. Sometimes I just want to pull my phone out and see some entertainment. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And I'm yeah. right here. I can see everything. I don't have to squint. I don't have to pack my glasses. You get what I'm saying? Hey, so, but all I'm going to say about Versus is it's an amazing way to bridge that gap of old school and new school. And I think that's mm -hmm. the cool thing about it. But Zoe, take it from here. Take us the break, Shardy. Yeah, well, you know, to I'm turn up. Period. Well, we have to take a quick break. But when we come back, our best friend at the mix, Tutti, is back to talk to us about all the great things he has going on this year, from new albums to the many festivals he's performing in. So keep it locked right here on Fox Soul. That's right. <laughs> 